Follow up now for the first time we are hearing from Savannah Mayor Van Johnson about lessons he's learned since the city cleared out the homeless encampment on President Street. The mayor is saying many of those who were displaced do not want assistance. WSAV's Nakia Harris has more. Tina and Ben during his weekly media briefing, Mayor Johnson was asked how he feels about what seems to be an uptick in homeless encampments in other parts of the city. He had this to say. Probably the, the biggest surprise um, about that. Mayor Van Johnson say he is surprised that many from the city's homeless population are turning down help from local agencies. We now have street teams. We have a day center. They choose to be there. They choose to be there. They don't want um, shelters. Um, they don't necessarily want um, some of the other things we can provide them. According to the mayor, although many residents are demanding the city to control the number of people experiencing homelessness, seen hanging out in public spaces, they cannot do anything about it. We have people calling our office, you know, do something about them, do something about them. We cannot remove people constitutionally from public space. On the other hand, when it comes to private property, that is a different story. Monday News 3 reported there is a homeless encampment on the south side of Savannah. The property they're settled on is privately owned. Alderman Curtis Perty said that there has been an increase in theft, suspicious calls, drug use, and medical calls in the area. There's a massive cleanup that has to take place. There's uh, drug paraphernalia, there's human waste, there's a lot of trash. Um, there's items out there that are more than likely. We reached out to the city to find out when they plan to clear out the, that south side property. A spokesperson says they're looking to start the process next week. Nakia Harris, WSAV News 3, on your side. Nakia, thank you. New at 6.